Hey guys, welcome back to Feel the Burn. Super excited today, guys. I have two very delicious looking hot sauces from the Gringo. Gringo True. Got the bruised orange and the original hoot sauce. Definitely looking forward to trying these out. If you want to get yourself a bottle, it's gringotrue.com. Before we get started, I'm going to ask you to gently karate chop that like button. Just kidding, guys. Make sure you hit that like button. Make sure you're subscribed to the channel. And make sure you hit that bell so you never miss a video upload. And you can catch me torturing myself with all of these hot sauces. I don't call it torture. I love it. I will be right back with the uh, tasting and uh, see you in a minute. All right, guys, I'm back. I'm going to be starting off with the hoot sauce. Give this a gander here. Alrighty. Here are the ingredients. We got Florida peppers, Florida produce, Florida sauce. A blend of habanero, cayenne, and Carolina reapers. This sauce will make you more Floridian than Mickey Mouse riding a gator to Walmart eating a pub sub. Oh boy. <laughs> it's pretty good. Alrighty, contains habanero, cayenne, Carolina reaper, garlic, white wine vinegar, bell peppers, carrots, onions, and spices. Which spices? I don't know. It's a mystery. Secret recipe. Alright guys, let's give this a sniff and then we'll give it a pour. <coughs> give this a shake. Wow, didn't expect that. I'm getting some pepper vibes here. A, a hint of sweetness. I think I'm picking up vinegar. A little saltiness in there. Carrots, that's what it was. Maybe a little of the bell pepper even. This is going to be interesting. I mean, just from the smell, it's uh, it's dynamic. It's not going to be what I expect when I taste it either. I'll tell you that right now. Give this a pour. Ooh. little chunkiness going on. I'm going with that. There's a good amount of substance there, okay? Sort of thin body, but sort of chunky at the same time. Just the scent is like a mystery. I can't put my finger on it. But you know what? Let's go for it. Cheers, guys. Let's get ready to feel the burn. Boom. Woo! <clears throat> I mean, the back of the throat. All right. Decent heat. All right. I see what you're doing here, gringo. So you got a lot of carrot flavor in there. I like carrots. Not too bad. Cayenne, for sure. Feel that cayenne all over the mouth, too. You got the, the, the habanero and the reaper. Taste the garlic on my lips a little bit. Wow. What I have to say of it is that it is a very unique hot sauce. It gives you all the heat you're looking for. Uh, it's, it's different enough for me to say I've never tasted a sauce quite like it. In a good way. Um, so I'm gonna, I, I, I'm gonna do my ratings in just a minute. Let me reset, and I will taste that bruised orange, and I'll uh, come back after that and then tell you what I think. All right, let's be back in one moment. All right, guys, I'm back. Gonna give a go at this bruised orange from Gringo True. Florida peppers, Florida produce, Florida sauce. Gringo True's bruised orange hot sauce. This sauce will be, in the words 
of our, oh man, I can't read the small writing. In words of our John Prine, make you eat everything that they put on your dish using Florida oranges, the citrus packed heat is like a patina, a little Florida sunshine mixed with a category five hurricane on your favorites. Uh, contains Florida oranges, habaneros, carrots, garlic, ginger, Florida honey, white vinegar, salt, onion powder, curry powder, and orange zest. Sorry it was so hard for me to read that, guys. I didn't mean to draw it out. And, uh, Gringo's who's bruised orange. So let's give it a shake. <clears throat> when I get small writing, man, I don't know what it is. It's like the letters kind of bleed together on me. the citrus you, you get the citrus right away and you get almost a, a looming background menacing heat smell peppers in there man you can tell good and chunky a lot going on give this a good pour oh yeah you got orange chunks in there oh man this is gonna be good Got all kinds of fun stuff happening there. Look at that. Mm mm mm. Green go to his bruised orange. Let's get ready to feel the burn. Cheers, guys. Sorry guys, I had a little <clears throat> bit of technical difficulty. I literally just tasted the sauce and my, my camera went on the fritz here. So it's working good now. I'm gonna take a fresh spoonful, try to equal the one I took previously. I'm gonna give you guys a good rating. Cheers, getting ready to feel the burnt again. So you're getting a really interesting dynamic from uh, not only the sweetness, but the very citrus nature of the orange. I think he did a really good job at using that. I mean, I've never had a, a hot sauce with orange, like orange base before, and it's uh, interesting. I've never tasted anything like it either one of these sauces. They're very unique. Flavor is uh, really interesting on this. I'm not even sure I can put my finger on what I want to fully say about it. It's uh, very orangey. You're getting a, a solid hit of heat. Uh, a little bit of saltiness. Um, I'm getting a, a good amount of, good amount of uh, everything is like the carrots, yeah real uh, generous portioning of those uh, carrots are uh, kind of chunky even and uh, kind of releases a little bit of flavor as you're, you're chewing it and moving it around your mouth um, really interesting uh, maybe that would probably be really good on uh, like a fish or something seafood um, I love the kick of heat though it's really good so I, I will be right back. I'm going to give you the rating uh, on both of these, and uh, we'll, we'll go from there. I'll see you in a minute. All right, guys, I'm back with the rating. <coughs> Sorry about that. <clears> Hot <throat> sauce got me in the back of the throat. Gonna start out with the hoot sauce. Uh, unique. 
absolutely a unique flavor. Matter of fact, I'm going to take a little dip of it so I can give you an unequivocal answer on this. There we go. Mm. Really good vinegary saltiness. Very all natural. Decent little kick of heat. I'm going to say flavor on this one. It is a very solid seven. Very unique, very interesting hot sauce. Uh, the heat isn't too uh, too forward to where it's going to hurt you. You can use this pretty liberally. I mean, it's there. It's a, it's a good burn. Um, I want to say the heat on this is a. I'm really on the fence here. A four. Pretty delicious overall uh, sauce. Uh, overall on this, I'm going to give this sauce a seven. Very decent, very versatile. Put it on pretty much anything. I enjoy it. Uh, now, this one it is almost like an enigma to me. This is a, a really interesting sauce. I've never tasted anything like this. Um, it kind of screams Florida, which I think is the point. Uh, you're getting a very orange forward. Um, you know, a lot of flavor from the from the carrots. Um, a little hit of saltiness in there, even. I mean, even the smell. Actually, the smell is kind of growing on me. I'm gonna take another little taste here. That'll give you guys my final rating. You know, this sauce grew on me. When I first tasted it, I would have called this flavor a five and a half. I'm gonna call the flavor of this sauce, it actually grew on me, six and a half. Pretty darn good. Um, <clears throat> now, heat on this gave me a, a pretty good hit of, of heat. All over the lips, um, Good kick of heat, uh, surprising, uh, and uh, kind of lasted in my mouth. I think this is hotter than, than the other one. So I'm gonna call the heat on this uh, four and a half. Decent amount of heat, um, and I think it's because it's the, the habaneros. You can tell these are, you know, everything's fresh in here, very delicious, um, very dynamic flavor. Overall on this sauce, I, I'm gonna give this sauce a six and a half so seven six and a half uh, the only reason six and a half is that um, I think this would go really good on uh, seafood okay I I don't know I'm, I'm gonna try it on pretty much everything uh, what it would taste like on a taco this instantly I go right to a taco with this it's uh, very versatile kind of put it on everything sauce I think this is more of a very specific sauce it's a very delicious um, craft hot sauce, and it, it grew on me from trying it for, for three times. Uh, so it's it, it, very interesting that I acquired a taste for it pretty fast. Uh, so thank you so much for joining me, guys. If you want to get yourself a bottle of this, once again, that's GringoTrue.com. Uh, follow this guy on Instagram. I got it right here. Yeah, Gringo True, once again, on Instagram. He's hilarious. He has some really funny videos. Definitely check it out. Um, make sure you like, subscribe, and hit the bell. Uh, check out our merch. We have our merch in the link down here below. Um, make sure you become a member of Mirabella TV. It really helps us out. Make sure you follow us on Instagram, Mirabella underscore TV. We do a lot of interviews with the makers of this hot sauce, so we have a lot of fun on there as well. And... Um, Trying to think if I ever got anything. I don't think I did. Thank you so much for joining us. Burn out.